not doing the show. Exactly that. We're singing a duet, Troy. A duet means two people. Well, mostly me in this case, but whatever, a duet. Employee. Employees aren't allowed in the show. No, 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 no. You're an honorary member. Not anymore. I asked Fulton for my kitchen job back. What? Trope, I don't like the way you've been treating my friends. And I don't like the way I've been treating them either. So I'm doing something about it. <laughs> An entire table of university boosters are coming to see you. Thanks to me. So I'll be their waiter. They'll be thrilled. Trey, Trey, this could change your life. Be more interested about what my friends think of me. And what I think of myself. Oh, we can all hold hands around the campfire some other time. Right now, we have a show to do. No. You've got a show to do. I got a kitchen to clean. Forget about the rest of us. How about the fact that your brother has worked extremely hard on the show? Oh, boo-hoo. He'll be in the show. He'll do his celebrity impersonations. And don't lecture me about Ryan, given the way you've been interfering with Troy's future. What? You've got him written up by Fulton for sneaking on the golf course, swimming after hours. I had to step in just to save Troy's job. I'm not interested in what you think you're doing for Troy. That's between you and him. But you're messing with my friends my summer, and that's not okay with me. You don't like the fact that I won. What's the prize? Troy? The Star Dazzle Award? You have to go through all of this just to get either one? No thanks, Sharpay. You're very good at a game that I don't want to play. So, I'm done here. But you better step away from the mirror long enough to check the damage that will always be right behind you. I said keep an eye on them, not turn them into the cast of Grease. Pretty cool, huh? Do you want us to lose the Star Dazzle Award to a bunch of dishwashers? Us? Well, I guess that's showbiz. When did you become one of them? You know, I'll take that as a compliment. But you and Troy have a good show, sis. Oh. We plan to. That new duet that Troy and Gabriel sing? I need it. Actually, it's not available. Repeat? Well, it's something I wrote for Troy and Gabriella, just in case they disagree. We're an employee here, not a fairy godmother. Let's have it. Transpose it to my key. Troy and I will be doing it in the talent show. Oh, and bring up the tempo. We'll need to keep people awake. What about our song? What about whom or whom? Change in plans. What am I supposed to do with my tiki warrior outfit? Tim for Halloween? Go to a luau? Sell it online. I don't know. But in the meantime, keep an eye on those wildcats. They're planning on being in the show, which I doubt once they hear about Troy and me. I don't want any surprises. Oh. And don't worry, we'll find something somewhere for you in the show. Or the next show. Don't strain yourself, Slick. My life is over. I've been a good girl. Never lied. Except when necessary. I've always bought my parents expensive gifts. Using their credit card, of course. I don't deserve this humiliation. How's your show going? How's it going? My show makes the captain his dad look like he's won the lottery. I'll sing with you, Sharpay. What? I promised. And I keep my promises. But what was the first thing you said to me when I started working here? Drinking more iced tea? Think harder. We're... All in this together. Exactly. Well, we are. So let's get out there and knock him dead, Troy Bolton. I do the show if the Wildcats do the show. <laughs> and I think fast. I just sort of wish you were doing this for me. You're a good guy, Troy. Actually, right now I think I like you better than I like myself. Did I just say that? Wait. Everything you said... You were... 
right? Yes. Thank you. You must think I'm a total fool. Nah. Not total. Maybe my dad was right. Maybe I'm not ready for this. Maybe I should just go home and work for him. I mean, did I really think I was just gonna come to Broadway and be a star? Yes. Because that's exactly how you think. It's perfect. Perfect is so hard. And it doesn't prepare you for disappointment. Well, if it helps, you still look adorable even when you're disappointed. Yeah, that doesn't help. Look, Sharpay, there is not a marquee big enough or lights bright enough to contain the fame you're gonna have. Yeah, but not the way I've been doing it. Like you said, the Sharpay you know isn't the Sharpay that has become the Sharpay that is this Sharpay. And did all the Sharpays follow that? I sacrificed integrity for opportunity. I let someone insecure distract me. I cleaned a bathroom. And worst of all, I disappointed someone I care about. I forgot what was really important to me. I lost track of what I want. And other than maid service and a canopy bed, what is it that you want? A fair fight. A lifetime in the spotlight. And maybe you'll still let me be in your movie. Burning hotels. I had to see the competition. Don't I get a burning hotels party? Tell me one thing. Were you with her? Yeah. Are you in love with Charlotte? What? You are. I'm not. I'm you, not. You had a thing. I don't care. Just remember, she's trouble. Girls like that always are. That's ridiculous. I'm not in love with Charlotte. You still haven't washed your hands yet. It was that special, being with her. I don't think I can do it, Try. I think I've run out of goodbyes. Why do you keep saying goodbye? I love you, Wildcat. But I need to stay right where I am. I'm sorry. Gabriel.